All right, guys, panels are out and wired. Screw this crap. This one's up. That one's up, that's what that meant to be. These guys I found, the ones that are left, they're all in the sun now, rebuilt as best as possible. Um, we'll use those for interior lights tonight. Found one here, another two here, and one there. So as the sun cooks them, these little bulbs will be our interior lights later on. A couple carrots there, or we'll eat those later. <laughs> when the going gets really tough. Okay, let's have a look at what we did in the solar. All right, this is a beautiful lithium. It's now hooked up to this little controller. Running these guys, which is charging those lights, charged my phone last night, saved my life. It's the only way I could keep the batteries going here, um, even though it was no phone, no phone service. And here's the main bank. The new bank is in. The new bank is charging at 14.2. Butamus. It's on the solar panel. These have all been reconfigured now for this lithium. This guy here and this guy too. It's set to 300 amp hours. So, <laughs> not bad. Not bad for nine o'clock the day after getting damn near dead. And these guys here are running. So this one, I've moved this from the old uh, boat AGMs over to this lithium. And the reason why is because I'm going to run the, bat the fridge off of this guy, dedicated 100%. And this guy we're going to dedicate to the uh, air conditioner, which is going to run off this inverter. Um, I just didn't have faith that these guys would run that air conditioner so well. So let's get this guy topped up. 14.3 is beautiful, beautiful. And 14.2, everybody's looking good. Let's bring in the appliances. Time for AC and fridge.